Welcome to Let's Talk Meshing's Tutorial Tuesday, where we show you how to use a feature in just a couple of minutes. You can see here I have a fresh session of PointWise without any entities. I have not imported any files at this time. I'm going to switch over to an Explorer window that I have on my Windows workstation. I've navigated to where PointWise is installed on my system in the Tutorials folder and currently in the Pipe in a Cube tutorial folder. I'm just simply going to click and drag on the pipe in a cube.pw file, which is a restart file, and drop it directly onto the PointWise interface. And when I switch back over to PointWise, you can see that the ending file for that tutorial has indeed uh, been imported directly uh, into PointWise. So real quick, let's do a file new and restart PointWise to clear the slate. And I'm going to switch back to my Explorer window, and this time uh, up a folder, and let's say, for instance, let's look at the uh, Layer Manager uh, tutorial folder. There's an IGES file here, so we can also import uh, CAD files in the same fashion. I'll drag and drop the 747nacell.igis file directly onto the interface, and it pops us right into the Import Database panel, which we normally get. Uh, of course, doing file I.O. Uh, via the file menu in, in an I.O. dialog. So, as usual, I could just click OK and take the defaults for importing the database file, and it directly imports that IGES file for us. A uh, quick introduction there to drag and drop for file import. If you like this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or comments, drop us a line down below or connect with us on Twitter, which is linked in the description. Thank you all and have a pleasant Tuesday.